Well, we have stopped at Treasure Point. Yeah, we're close. So today we're going to do something I've been wanting to do for years and years and years. We're going to go hike Norman Island. So now legend has it that these trails were used by pirates. I don't think we got a trail here. Oh, God, be careful. I almost just dumped Those all are over. What are you guys did? That's amazing. That's incredible. Now time for that full moon party. Look at that. You're supposed to wear the eye patch. Well, I know. We have stopped at Treasure Point. The Indians were really crowded as you saw, so we just came over to Treasure Point, which is around the corner from uh, Norman Island and the Willie T. And <laughs> we're close. Just have to be careful when you're backing in on a ball here just to make sure that you fit. I'm 54 feet. I wouldn't suggest anyone more than 54 feet coming in here. There are other balls that are further out. This is the closest ball to the cave. And as you see, the ball has got a long line on it, so we got short lines on ours, just to make sure I stay off those rocks. My crew is going out snorkeling. They're gonna go straight to the caves over here. Wait, hold it, over there. I'm not going in because of my leg. I need it to stay dry, so. But this is a primo place to stop, if you can't stop. We tried to stop at the Indians, but it was full, so we came over here. Wave, guys, hello. Hello. Wow, some amazing drone footage. I don't get to swim, at least I get to fly the drone. That was fun. Everybody happy with that? I thought that was a hundred times better than Yeah, it was. Okay. Than the Indians? This is, this well, you haven't been to the Indians. I know. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you went here instead. Yeah. Oh, I'm glad you guys had a good time. Well, here we are on another incredible morning. Right, Jess? Amazing. Amazing. So today we're going to do something I've been wanting to do for years and years and years. We're going to go hike Norman Island been wanting to hike for years and years, years. years and years yeah ever since i saw this place oh okay yes this is a new hike yes a new hike. i'm glad we clarified that yes, yes so now legend has it that these trails were used by pirates to get up high and to take a look and see you know who they wanted to pirate what was coming in is that what they do to the pirate people they pirate they steal crap right yeah. plunder pillage they, ah Plunder and pillage. So anyway, if you go to the, what was it, Greg? Southeast, which is this direction over here, which is right over where the Lex. Willie T is, it's a, it's a lot longer hike than if you go over here to the north side. Uh, and the views on either side are amazing because you see across the channel. So here we go. Kind of like a ghost town here before noon. And I'm told you walk in between the main restaurant and the dive shop, and that's where the trail starts. So, dive shop, restaurant, and go right between, and here's the trail. So we went in there, and then we just took a left at the fork, which will take us over to the north side, I think. Okay, we just went in a big circle and right back where we are. I don't think we got a trail here. Here it is. It's here. It's here. Whew. We're back at the beach. Okay, so don't go in between the restaurant and the dive shop. <laughs> if, you, if you want to go to the north, just come to the end of the beach and hang a left. Now we are climbing. What a view, huh? Shame about getting it. So not a groomed trail. 
because of the extreme heat that's going on and the trail getting harder and harder to find it still does go we've just decided we're a little too warm we're gonna come back some great cardio and some incredible views okay post hike we're all inside because it's just too stinking hot outside <laughs> They're having yes. mimosas. The thing happens on the last day, you gotta get rid of all the food, right? This baby's going on the hard in, a, in about a month, so well. we made all the eggs, or well, the gals made the eggs, simply because we got a ton of them left. Hard boiled eggs, double eggs, and a ton of hot dogs. <laughs> gotta get rid of it. What an incredible day. Headed back to Nanny Key now. Uh, you want to get in the old Slip B7 and um, tidy up, get ready to go to the full moon party tonight. I've been so excited about going to the full moon party at Trellis Bay for years and years. And so, just happened to land on tonight. We're flying out tomorrow. So, we can go, go back to Nanny Key, then go to the party tonight. Nothing better than impromptu lunches and meals on a boat. Look, we got the ships, dogs. Figuring, oh, figuring out things with what you got in the fridge, right? Yeah. Uh, you can't forget about the multi-purpose lubricant. Yes. <laughs> that is delicious. Natural for any lunch. Oh, thank you. Oh, so God, much. be careful. I almost just dumped Those all Those are our baby eggs. Yeah, so, what? what? What is this? Look what you guys did. That's amazing. <laughs> Incredible. Exactly. Nobody's playing along. See, they actually yes. gave me these like four days ago, and I'm just now pretending to see them. Yeah. <laughs> and we ate it was half. dark, and we couldn't. And we ate half recorded. of them before because we just didn't want to wait in. So tell me who made them again? Paige, PJ, on the back. PJ, sweet treat. They are good. She is amazing. She's a Omaha. Yes. Okay, beautiful evening. Now time for that full moon party that I've heard so much about at Trellis Bay here. And here comes the guy taxi. Well, here we are. Here's Trellis Bay. Here's the market. So live band. Big live band. Very loud live band. Bushwaka! Bushwhacker and wine, interesting. Everybody knows it's difficult when you come in, there's a lot of dinghies, but look at all these dinghies. Probably about 50 dinghies here. Walk down a little bit further to this. 